Buyer love letters were historically used to appeal to the seller and in certain markets stand out amongst a pile of other offers. They were considered seemingly harmless and often helped my personal clients, so I've always encouraged a letter to attach to my clients' offers. I've seen them tip the boat in our direction several times, but believe it or not, these actually these letters are actually starting to raise fair housing concerns. How is that? Well, they often reveal characteristics of the buyer, such as race, religion, family status, and if these factors influence the seller's decision, it's against fair housing laws. So these days to protect us and our clients from fair housing liability, we are directed by the NAR, National Association of Realtors, to actually discourage buyer love letters. We are not even supposed to read them and for sure we're not supposed to deliver them. And it basically means that the terms and black and white print on the contract are all that the seller sees when making a decision about a buyer. What do you think about that?